Hey, it's Jeffrey Boyer Chapman. You're watching New You. So what can we expect from your character this season? Um, so much. The writers have really developed Jay into a beautiful, fully developed 3D human being in so many ways. He's the moral compass of the show this season. He is surrounded by this world of chaos and manipulation and lies and deceit, and he's finally reached a place where he is no longer willing to play that game. He sees everyone else around him progressing so rapidly um, by playing a really dangerous game of selling their soul. Um, he's wanting to do the opposite, make thoughtful, impactful, important television while still, uh, while not compromising his integrity while protecting his contestants and protecting uh, the suitor BJ Britt this season. Um, so, uh, you know, uh, to see the world through the, through the eyes of Jay's, to see that everything that is going on around him is really messed up and maybe not as okay as we've all convinced ourselves that it is. I'm looking forward to seeing. Me too. And do you and Chet have any more like boys' nights out this season? You know, uh, I think Jay learned his lesson from last season that aligning himself with Chet didn't really get him anywhere, unfortunately. Um, we do have a couple of interesting scenes together, but Jay knows better at this point. He's no longer intimidated by him, and if anything, he's just like, if we do work together, we're going to do it my way. And at New You, we focus a lot on uh, health and fitness, so what do you do to stay in shape? Yoga. I, yoga is really the only thing that I do to stay in shape. I live in New York. I walk everywhere. Um, I eat mainly vegan and vegetarian as well. So. And have you ever seen The Bachelor? I have seen The Bachelor. Yeah, I actually saw, I watched Andy's season. So I'm so excited. I just met her upstairs. I'm so excited to. Yeah, I'm excited to stand and have a conversation with her. Yeah. <laughs>